morning, the most news in the morning, period. With day six Easter. You wanna try me? You wanna try me tonight? You think you have a bad night? I will ruin your night. You wanna try me? Do you wanna try me, young boy? You wanna try me tonight, young boy? Do you wanna go to jail for some reason I come up with? You wanna see who knows the law better? Me or you? The officer was suspended after that tape was posted on YouTube and Google. Brett Darrow is the man who was behind the wheel who had rigged up that camera, and he joins me now from St. Louis. Brett, thanks for being with us. Thank you for having me. Were you scared when, when the officer started screaming at you? Yeah, I was actually I was extremely scared. Uh, I thought I might get uh, hurt or assaulted. I didn't know what was going, going to happen. Let's listen to a little bit more of the confrontation. This is with Sergeant James Kenline. Ever get smart mouth with a cop again? I show you what a cop does. Do you understand me? Try and talk back. Talk back to me again. And I bet I can say you resist arrest or something. You want to come up with something? I come up with nine things. So he appears to be saying he's going to make up charges against you. Uh, your your decision at that point was to put this video onto the internet so that others could see it and hear it for themselves. Uh, did you try to go to the police and say this is what happened to me? Well, actually, I kind of just posted it among friends, and a couple of friends spread it out over the internet, and people were so outraged, and I had so much support that it just basically took off on its own. I didn't have to do anything. I woke up one morning, and it was everywhere. Uh, this officer has since been uh, put on uh, unpaid suspension right now, uh, condemned by his, uh, his supervisors. But let's um, answer a couple of the questions he, he asked you um, before the tirade. He was saying, what are you doing in, in a commuter parking lot at 2 o'clock in the morning? What were you doing there? I was actually, I was meeting up with my friend to get my cell phone that I left their house. Um, I just pulled in there. It's a 24-hour commuter lot. I figured that it wouldn't be suspicious but the officer thought otherwise, I guess. And then uh, you didn't immediately give him your ID. Why didn't you just do it since it was, you know, 2 o'clock in the morning and you were there by yourself? Well, when he asked me for it, I started to get it out, and as I was uh, getting out of my wallet, I asked him, you know, uh, had I done something wrong? If there was a problem, if they were looking for someone, I wanted to help, you know, figure out what was going on. Uh, you know, and why did you have the dash cam in the first place? Well, actually, about a year and a half ago, I got a traffic ticket. I didn't think I deserved it. There was really no way for me to prove my side. I thought, well, what better way than to have video evidence if uh, I get another one ever again? And I guess it helped out this time. All right, but real quick before we let you go, let's just hear a little bit more of this confrontation. I might give you a ticket for that. Let me come up with some more. When you turned in, you failed to use your turn center, the right turn center. You want to try me some more? Huh? Come on, smart. Give me an attitude a little bit more. I bet you I can guarantee I towed this car by the time I'm done. Do you think that unpaid suspension is enough? What would you like to see happen to this officer? Uh, I'd like to see the officer fired. I thought what his conduct was uh, ridiculous. And now the patrol car video is missing. Uh, it's, they can't, the chief can't find it. So uh, I think this officer needs to be fired. Did you end up getting a ticket? No, actually, I think he realized that uh, with my camera that he would just get escalate the situation more by giving me a ticket or arresting me that night.